Lesson 3, Geometry, Terms and Labels in Geometry, Align Segment, Labeling, and, and Details. Okay, so again, we have a line segment. And remember, a line segment is a one-dimensional idea that connects two points along a straight path, okay? So the thing to remember about a line segment is you have to identify it. So we're going to identify a line segment by its points, which are also endpoints, or a less commonly used terminology for the endpoints of a line segment are its aardvarks. Okay, let me just write all this out. So here you have um, a line segment these are called points and points and for those of you erudite brainiacs out there um, if you want to know more exclusive terminology for a point on a line segment you can um, identify them as ard barks okay and so we're going to call the um, first line point A, and just to maintain parallelism, B. This could be Z, C, D, any combination you want. So this is how you identify and label a line segment by its points. But now, if you're writing out and referring to this line segment in some type of mathematical sentence on a test, or an exam, the way you would go about doing that is like so. You would write the letter A, which corresponds to the first point, B, which corresponds to the second, and you would write an overline above it. And this denotes the line segment AB, or you can write an overline BA, and it would still refer to the line segment BA. There's really no directionality with the line segment, so it doesn't matter which letter you write first. But I would, my brain goes to this as the default um, identification just to write AB uh, to go in order to make things um, less confusing. So earlier I said a line segment is a one dimensional idea. You can travel back and forth from A to B or from B to A. But a line segment technically has no width. If you travel up and down or in this direction or in any other direction other than directly linearly between the endpoints, you're off the line segment. So it's just a one dimensional idea where you can travel um, back and forth, okay? And a line segment has no width. So you label by endpoints. That's the first takeaway message. You can travel back and forth in one dimension, secondly, um, takeaway message, 